Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. My Country 96.1, Fathead, Candy Roth. We're discussing this when we, you know, we just had tree work done a couple weeks ago. And uh, Dana and I were discussing occupations. Not that I'm sitting here with a list. I just, I thought of this because we're talking about trees. Occupations where... Uh, people are not only uh, getting booked and and don't even have any openings to do any more work, but they're occupations where uh, homeowners can't necessarily handle the work, like tree removal. Uh, from for the most part, unless you are uh, big and strapping and and strong and have a chainsaw. You cannot do tree removal. You have to hire a company, Candy. You know what I'm Absolutely saying? Absolutely true. You shouldn't even attempt it. It's dangerous. Right. Uh, so, I mean, I remember watching the guys do the trees a couple weeks ago. They're climbing up there. They're, they're, they're at the top of the tree. They're using ropes and all these stuff. So, I mean, tree removal companies are going to be extremely busy um, and, and I wonder how it is if you're a tree removal guy and you're sitting in your house watching a storm, there's got to be a part of you that's like, this is good ka-ching, for business. Yeah, ka-ching, exactly. Ka-ching, ka-ching, ka-ching. I mean, seriously, there's, uh, X amount of jobs like that and tree removal is one of them. So, uh, uh, and I know the, uh, all the, all the power line, uh, guys and girls will be, uh, will be out there in full force over the next few days and, and weeks to, to get things oh, yeah. done. Oh yeah. Absolutely. Um, I said some ridiculous things going on in the country. I saw, now I don't have it in front of me, but I saw, I think it was a governor of Mississippi, uh, ordered a full mask wearing mandate because he wants to see college football in September. Candy, this is his reasoning for wearing a well, mask. Well, I guess there's a reason for everything. All right, you just wear the mask. If that's your reason, wear the mask. You got another one? Wear the mask. I you suppose. getting the point here? Wear the mask. I suppose that's the... Uh, I want to keep getting my nails done, okay? Wear the mask. That's actually not... Yeah, it's a, not a bad uh, uh, campaign. It's a, it's a good... It's a great one. It's a good platform. I want to go to TJ Maxx. Wear the mask. You get it's, it. Wear the mask. Wear the wear the wear the ma- wear the mask. Everybody, put the mask on. Whatever you want to do, your favorite thing. So, uh, yeah, I mean, think about that for a second. Uh, you want to be able to do what you want to do over the next uh, couple of years. Wear, wear the, the mask. mask. Uh, speaking you need of groceries, which, wear the mask. How about this couple from New Zealand? They got stranded on the Falkland Islands during their honeymoon in March. They made it home. They got a 5,000 nautical mile ride on an Antarctic fishing boat, Candy. Oh, that's very cool. And they finally made it home. Wow. It's been what four months. What a story to tell. Yeah, I mean, talk about a honeymoon. Um, the woman in Florida who intentionally coughed on a cancer patient uh, who asked her to wear a mask in a store has been arrested. Good. Good. Happy Good, about that. A lethal weapon at this point. Listen, there's no doubt in my mind if, if that that's uh, almost as good as attempted murder right there. If you're coughing on a cancer patient, you you possibly have coronavirus. Yeah, absolutely. You you need to be arrested. An investment banker named Lindsay Reckler rewrote Goodnight Moon as Good Morning Zoom. It's a parody of modern life. Oh, Katie. I think I did see that. I love Good. Good, good, good night, Moon. Yes, and that's Isn't that being, the original. Yes, Good Night, Moon, and that's being uh, that's being published. And uh, one of the dumbest things I've ever seen: a group of event planners and experts in Los Angeles are getting criticized because they held a ninety-person live event to discuss the loss of live events, Candy, which makes no <laughs> sense. <laughs> They aren't really experts, are they? Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. No, they're not. My Country 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1.